Hey my gorgeous friends, what's up? It is Ipsy Add-On Day. I love add-on days. And in uh, June, added on. And I don't think this month I'm going to, except I do want the ultimate bag. We'll see how things go though. Can't promise. So let's get into it. I have the review of my products for June. I also picked up the May... Um, mystery glam bag plus so i'm going to show that real quick too so first off here's the bag i almost couldn't find it because i forgot where i put it it's got this little tassel of course it says ipsy with all the ladies here sunbathing and everything it's just so summery and so cute and really, I probably will put this in my beach bag, maybe. And then it's just yellow inside with Ipsy tag. I do like, I like, the, just like the quality of Ipsy bags. Sorry, shaking you there. I am being lazy and I'm doing this on my bed. So, sorry, I'll try not to get overexcited. So, very cute bag this month. Alright, and the theme was Make Waves. And, um, and I'm sorry, I just don't have the prices and I didn't look them up beforehand. And, um, I think Ipsy is really just trying to get you to go on their app, but I like having a card to look at about the products. And then they had started, uh, at least for the glam bag anyways, putting like, if it's, um, the deluxe sample, but then putting the full size price on it, or it would say full price full size like if you got a brush and then give them the price for that I really like that and I don't know why it stopped because we got like what two months of that or something but um you can maximize your SPF this month so there's that now let's get into this my and I even forgot to look up everything but this is what I added on it is the uh, Sugar Matte as Hell Crayon Lipstick, and this is in the shade Viola. And I do like this. I mean, it is matte, 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 and it's really pretty. And it being like this type of lip product, it's not like a liquid lip lip. It doesn't dry out or anything. And of course, it's more towards like a lipstick, so it does wear off, but it is really pretty and I love just how matte it is how comfortable it feels on my lips so I definitely recommend this uh, I'm trying to see okay next I did get the KVD translucent powder I do like this packaging and it's just you know just regular translucent powder it does the job it's not any better than any other so um, if you're looking for a new setting powder I would recommend this it sets everything really nicely and really smooths you out a little so that's nice uh, sorry I'm trying to remember what I added okay So this is something else that I got in my bag. It's this cleanser, and you can see I've only tried a little bit because it did make me break out. It is a um, it's oil cleanser, and um, right now I'm just I haven't really been out in the sun all that much yet, so my skin hasn't dried out. So this is not good if you have oily skin. I'm going to tell you that right now. But if you do have drier skin, this would be perfect for you guys and like a lot of my products I have been receiving I'm like I'm going to save this for after a beach day where I really need the extra moisture or after the pool or something so I mean it smells good so and it cleans your face if that's all you're looking for <laughs> then you got it next is I did get a brush from Eddie Funkhauser I have not tried this brush yet and just simply because I have all these other brushes that are the same shape and everything. But it's it's really sturdy um, and soft. This was definitely good. Would be good. Excuse me, I'm trying to rush and I shouldn't try to rush because then I get all jumbled up. But this would be good for your crease and everything. So there's 
that. And like I said, I haven't tried it yet because I just have all these other brushes right now that I'm really liking. So I haven't tried that. And then the last product that um, Ipsy chose. I'm going to throw this away now anyways. It came in this little box. It is uh, I-N-M Velveteen Dream Shadow. And I got it in the shade Queen B. So here's the packaging. There we go. I usually try to save the boxes for our reviews just so you can see. Now this is also, they said this was an also full size product. So here's that in the back. And it's just your standard gold shadow. It's really pretty, really soft. I wish that it was a bit more opaque. I mean, even if I tried to build it up and only got so far. But it's really pretty on the lid and everything. So I don't know if I'm going to be grabbing for it a whole bunch though. All right, let's get to what I added on now that I've got all that all over me. <laughs> so I've never tried Sunday Riley before. So I went ahead and picked up two Sunday Riley products because um, I do have acne. Uh, I picked up their Saturn Sulfur Acne Treatment Mask. Now, I've only been doing this once a week, but I've noticed a very slight difference in it getting rid of um, past breakout, um, like the discoloration that they leave. So I am definitely thinking about getting the full size of this. It's green, and you guys, it stinks. It just stinks so bad. And But I put up with smell because I do see a difference. Let's see, see, it's green. Which I don't care that it's green, it just really stinks. But it works, it's working, so that's what I'm doing. And then next I picked up this UFO Ultra Clarifying Acne Treatment Face Oil. Did you know if you, you, if you have oily skin that you should still put some sort of face oil on? because then it helps your skin stop producing so much of what would clog your pores and everything. So I picked this up. As you see, I've used it day and night. And um, I've also noticed that, let's see, so you can see it's like down to here now. But um, it's a nice little glass bottle. It has this little dropper and it also green and it also stinks um, I also noticed that it's helped to clear up my skin from the discoloration and everything and it says it's supposed to help future breakouts and I don't know if it's just one of those months or what but I had a lot more acne um, than normal with what I was doing beforehand when I added this um, so I don't know what that's about you know just around that time of month so I don't know maybe it was just one month that's like my skin's like ha 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 we're gonna get you or what so um I'm actually debating on whether or not I'm going to buy the full size on this product I'm gonna think about it but it has been actually helping clear up the discoloration from um prior breakouts so that's is one thing I'm looking for Okay, next I did pick up another eye treatment and I've actually noticed no difference in my eyes whatsoever. I mean, they're moisturized, but I haven't noticed any fine lines leaving, um, any tightening, nothing. It's just a moisturizer to put under your eyes. That's it. I won't buy the full size. Like I said, I was out of the other one, so I did add this on. Uh, next I picked up these. These are so fun. It gives a little tint to your lips. It's the, um, I don't know how to pronounce it. It's this right there. Let's see if I can get it to focus. M. 
A E L L E. Clearly brilliant tinted lips. I love these. These are so great for summer. It's just it's just a fun product to have. Just swipe it on your lips and go. That's it. So I do recommend these just to have something fun for summer and everything. And this I actually used some points to get is the Kula Mineral Sun Silk Cream. I wanted something that I could uh, just apply to like my forehead, my nose, and my cheeks um, before I did my makeup or even if I'm just going out for the day, something I can have regularly. And I love this. It has not broken me out, which is amazing. Um, so I am definitely going to get the bigger size of this. Um, it's, I went to Ulta and I saw the size. It's pretty big. And if I'm going to only use it for my face, it's going to last forever. So this I definitely recommend. I'm so glad I used my points to get this. Well, that is it for my June um, bag. I'm sorry I didn't have the prices, but let's hurry up and get into this May bag real quick. And I'm going to tell you one thing. Uh, when I received my May glam bag, I also added the ultimate to it. So I got this. There's the glam bag. Here's the ultimate. And then I picked up the May's um, glam bag, glam bag plus mystery bag just for the bag. Just, just for the bag. Just wanted the bag. I wanted all three bags. Now this one has this little tassel like this. This one has a tassel like this. And this, uh, my tassel came off, but this one has a tassel like this. And I just, I wanted the full set. So I got the mystery glam bag. But we are going to go over products real quick. Because this one actually did this. Um, Colored Rain Mimosa Moment Eyeshadow Palette did catch my eye. So I went, when I first opened these, I always use like a nail file or something. And I don't have it, but I'm throwing away the boxes now. So it comes like this. And then all the words on the back. And then I have it like this. Now, I told her I was excited about this because I have a colored rain liquid lip that I love. I adore it. And it does have a mirror right here. And then those are the colors. These are the colors I wear all the time. So I was excited that they uh, had the mimosa palette in here. And um, I don't know, after that liquid lip I have that I love... This is kind of lackluster for me, but it's going to be great to travel with this or whatever. If you just need something on your beauty desk or wherever you do your makeup, just to have regular everyday colors. This, I mean, it definitely works and it can build. It just seemed a little lackluster to me after I had that liquid lip, but I mean, it's still good eyeshadow. I'll still use it. And I just, I love their branding. It is so cute. All right. Oh, you guys, I forgot. I added on these mini scoops, too, into <laughs> my June bag. Because I see them all the time, and I want to try them. I haven't tried them yet. So it's just three uh, face masks. They all, something just to have fun with. They all smell wonderful. Something for a relaxing moment. So that was another add-on. And this was considered full size, so I paid $12 for these. But still, it's fun. Okay, getting back to May's bag. They also included the Girlatic um, Skin Glow Duo. And I got mine in the shade Moonlight. Look at that. I love this packaging. It's really pretty. It's like a mirror finish there. And then... I kind of have this on today. It's a Skin Glow Moonlight. It's like cream highlighters. I do love the packaging. And then there's that. I have used it. And I don't know. I think I like powder highlights better. But I mean, it, they're both pretty. Let me see. And then... Uh, 
right there. That's probably the worst spot to put it, but I have that eyeshadow on. So, I mean, it is pretty. And, um, just fun to have, I guess. If, if I think I would like that if I had, like, a no-makeup day and just put it on the high points just to have a little glow is what it... But I, I'm like powder highlight better so you guys I'm sorry I'm gonna be making you nauseous with all the shaking I'm doing I'm really not trying to all right next is this sugar coat um by sugar rush uh if you don't know Tarte has this little sister brand called sugar rush and this is their sugar coat liquid lip um velvet liquid lipstick it does that's what I'm wearing now and it's just, I just put it on really light to have a little bit of color. And mine's in the cupcake. To tell you the truth, this is the first time I put it on. And I was kind of scared because it looked kind of brown to me. So, I love it. I love this packaging. It's so cute. And it says cupcake on the back. Like I said, it looked a little too brown to me. But once you put it on, it's really pretty. That's what it is. Here. Let's see. Build it up just a little for you guys. And it's it's matte, but it's not like one of those drying down mattes. So it would wear off. Let's see. I really like it. And then... Let's see. This Mud Musky, I've just used this once. I'm not sure I like this or not. It's, a, it's supposed to be a serum that you put on after you use clay mask or whatever. And, um, see, it's just kind of a whitish serum you put on. And, uh, and you know, I broke out after using this. So I'm going to have to try again to see if that was the cause of my breakouts or what so I'm not sure it says you can use this morning and night it's pH balanced extra smoothing anti-aging feeding protecting nourishing it's supposed to be an after mask vitamin serum uh, I'm going to try it again and I'll see um, if you have any comments about this I guess you can say do you like this do you not like this um, I don't really see the value of having an after serum mask but we'll see I'll try it again and see if I break out again I'm just waiting until all mine goes down right now to see and then last I got the high def defining volumizing mascara by beauty for real and I'm not opening this um, I'll show you the outside packaging but I'm not gonna show you the wand because I have so many mascaras right now that I'm using and it's just black it's just black. So that was it. So I thought for the Miss Big, I hate that you have to pay like more, like $5 more for the mystery bag than if I did the glam bag, but I wanted the bag. So I was going to do it. And that's why I got in. I got good products. Um, I mean, an eyeshadow, highlight. It's not going to go off your pro profile because it's a mystery bag. But then the lipstick, the mascara, and this. So, I think it was a pretty good mystery bag. Um, tell me what you guys thought. What did you get in yours? I am so sorry. I keep forgetting that this is just going to bounce when I move. So, tell me what you thought. What did you get? What did you like? Um, what's your opinions on anything I showed you today? How does it work on you? You guys have a wonderfully blessed day and I'll see you later.